Waalaikumsalam warahmatullahi wabarakatuh. Your okay, case is law. Um, what it is is, um, I'd like to ask Brother Abu Muhammad. You know when people go to see these beers, they jump in without doing slapless bakara. Um, I personally have had an experience where I've done Salatulis Bukhara to go and see someone in India and it came back unfavorable. I was told to open up the visa that was sent to me by him and the, the tickets for the visa, everything was already prepared. But then when the, the visa were opened, we'd seen that in the, the visa was um, like one man standing with the left hand forward, left foot forward, a lazening on the left leg. Also, um, also, also, when people, I'm sorry, I can't speak no more. Bismillah, Bismillah. بسم الله والصلاة والسلام على رسول الله اللهم لا سهلا إلا ما جعلته سهلا وأنت الذي إذا شئت تجعل الحزن سهلا اللهم سهل اللهم سهل أو oh الله give her the speech إن شاء الله اللهم give her the power to continue her speech يا الله كاريون إن شاء الله كاريون إن شاء الله السلام عليكم عليكم السلام سوري بيك about that, um, but when I'm doing Salat al Kara and the Thawiz, I've opened up as well, there were three Thawiz, one for under my pillow, one to carry with me, and the one that I had to carry with me when it was opened up had a face on it with, um, you know like how a noose is around a person's neck? That was on it. It had Firaun's name in it, Abu Jahal's, Haman's, and all this and that. Wow. Um, and this is what I'm curious about, is why do people not do Salat al before going to see somebody? I personally done Salat al to see Brother Abu Muhammad. It was snowing. Everyone told me not to go to see him. It's snowing, you're going to get stuck and everything. And I found that Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala opened the doors for my um, treatment to be started, alhamdulillah. alhamdulillah. And it's... It's been really good because, alhamdulillah, I can start reading my namaz now. I can start doing good things again. Whereas when it comes back on me is by my own mistake. By I find this time I've made a mistake. See? And because they don't want me to go to court, and I haven't gone to court, this is my mistake. Wow. See? And the jinns themselves have told Brother Abu Muhammad my they sister, are here to prevent me from going to court. My sister, why why they pre prevent you to go to court? Because they do not want me to speak against a brother. So do so do you do do you mean a magician or somebody send this jinn to block you to speak or to go to court? <laughs> You blocked her, Ya Adullah. You enemy of Allah, you blocked her, huh? <laughs> but inshallah, Allah tabaraka wa ta'ala block you in this dunya, in the akhirah. Remember, Ya Ayyuhal Jinn, remember, inshallah, that you are going to stand before Allah, Yawm al Qiyamah, and Allah is going to ask you why you enter this body. What you are going to say to Allah Ta'ala, Yawm al Qiyamah, Yawm la yanfa'u malun wa la banun, illa man ata Allah bi qalbin salim. Huh? Oh. All right. What you are going to say to Allah Ta'ala or the jinn in that body? No. What you are going to say to Allah Ta'ala? No. What you are going to say to Allah? Are you, are you Muslim or non-Muslim? No. Muslim or non-Muslim? No. Muslim or non-Muslim? Who created you? Who created you? Who created you? Who created you and why? Huh? Remember that you are going to stay before Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala. You are going to die, yeah? 
I remember Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala, Yom Al-Qiyamah, He will ask you why you entered the body of that lady. What you are going to say to him, Ya Allah, forgive me. The magician is the one who told me, go and ruin her life. Go and stop her talking. Yes? But it will be late, Allah will send you to Jahannam wa Khalidina fiha. Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala mentioned in the Quran, and He said, don't fear them and fear me if you're a believer. May Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala give our sister, inshallah, huh? Inshallah, give her, inshallah the strength and give her iman and give her power, inshallah. Walaikum salam wa rahmatullahi wa barakatuh. Okay, so so. Um, what it is, is um, I'd like to ask Brother Abu Muhammad, you know when people go to see these beers, they jump in without doing salat with al Um, I personally have had an experience where I've done salat al to go and see someone in India, and it came back unfavorable. I was told to open up the visa that was sent to me by him, and the the tickets for the visa, everything.